Again, thanks for everyone joining. Sorry for the delay. I uh, hit the power button on my power cord and restarted everything before I started this webinar. Um, again, my name is Josh Fred, I'm the CEO and founder of Accelerate. Just a little bit about Accelerate. We are a mortgage CRM and marketing platform. Um, you know, we really pride ourselves on having uh, advanced innovation, te innovative technology um, in the marketplace. We have a lot of integrations to a lot of different softwares, different platforms, which is allowing us to more rapidly deploy new technologies like AI um, and different, you know, new tools as they come on the marketplace. So a little bit more about Accelerate. We have, you know, a handful of core products. We have our CRM and lead management, which is going to manage your customers, your referral partners, give you reporting on them. Um, we have marketing automation, our engagement platform that's going to engage with your referral partners and your customers. Um, and, you know, whether you're using it for recruitment as well, recruit loan officers, it's going to engage with them, whether it's email or text message or social media or phone call or direct mail the platform can handle that for you. We also have our agent connect product that's going to allow you to have a um, great relationship with your real estate agents and give you co-marketing flyers and um, single property page landing pages with, um, you know, co-brand with yourself and your real uh, real estate agents. And we also provide content and content library that gives you the ability to market to your partners, referral partners, um, automate, post your social media pages, schedule, post to Facebook and Instagram. So really kind of round, a well-rounded product um, just around CRM and marketing as well. But what I want to talk about today is just a little bit about AI and just Real briefly, just to kind of give everyone, you know, like I think the larger picture of AI and people wonder, is AI going to replace humans in it everywhere? No, not everywhere, but it's going to replace a lot of repetitive tasks um, and it's going to really help um, us become a lot more efficient. And where AI becomes really impactful, um, I borrow this slide from a, a friend of mine, um, Neil Sohota is an author and AI specialist, and he put this together. He says, listen, at the end of the day, you have human intelligence. That's people and experiences. We're flexible, creative, empathetic, instinctive. Right? We have all these different qualities that are very unique to humans. Machine intelligence is fast, efficient. It's cheap. It's scalable. It's consistent. Right? It's data. It's algorithm. It's learnings. It's based off of previous experiences only of of outcomes, not emotions or context. And you know, by itself, it it can be powerful. But really, when you put those two things together you get this kind of hybrid intelligence of how you can make, you know, this human intelligence better at what they do. Um, we are working on uh, an AI in several different places within our software. One of the areas is in our um, marketing content. So I'm actually going to log in and show you how to create some content with inside of uh, uh, our platform. And then, you know, before I do that, I want to talk about just other areas we're looking at AI. You know, we currently bring in text messages phone calls, phone recordings. We're integrated to, this is just a list of the phone systems. There's many more. These are just some of the larger phone systems out there. We're finishing up an integration to Microsoft Outlook to get the email. We already have integration to the calendar. So soon, you know, we're going to have this picture of all your customer data, phone call recordings, right? There's voice to text. Um, you can, you know, get that translated. You're going to have when someone called you, emailed you, text you, did they respond to you? What did they say? What did they respond to? How often they respond to? All this data, all this reporting, all put together. Then you can start interacting with systems like this, right? That can tell you things all about your customers, how they respond, when to respond to them, how, they sh how you should approach them, what their personality traits are. And then you can start really understanding how to engage with their people, speak in their language, their time in and really maximize their engagement every time. So that's kind of, you know, the future of where you'll start seeing AI in our platform. But right now I wanna hop in and actually show you where, um, a couple of areas where you can use AI right now. One second, I'll pull up. Uh... All right, so now one of the things about, um, Using not just you know everyone chat GPT is what's really made AI, you know really front and center for so many people. And one of the areas that you rather think about using chat GPT, it's really the prompts and what you ask it. Um, I was working on this a little bit before the demo and this webinar just to kind of go over some prompts. 
And when I ask it certain things, like write me, you know, the five top reasons for this, it would just write me just that five top reasons, nothing else, nothing more. And it's really about being descriptive, write me this for this long and this structure for these people with these problems or for who, why, it's how you prompt them. I'm going to hop into in touch, which is uh, our engagement platform. I'll hop into our newsletter. So we actually, as a service, create newsletters um, and put them in the platform for you, format it, and everything's all set up for your partners, your referral agents. But I'm showing you if you were using our newsletters, and let's say you want to start creating your own newsletters, and you want to use ChatGPT to make that happen for you. Let's go to use new editor. I'm going to click the update. Now, it's going to pop this home newsletter, a current one. Uh, we have this great little email editor in here allows you to really build structures. So this already has, let's say, a recipe in it. We may want to update that. Um, you know, talking about the market. You know, I could do something simple as with my current text, launch AI and say, make this shorter or make this longer. So make it shorter. This is actually going to go to chat GPT. It's a plugin. It's going to run, make it shorter. It's going to run a prompt. It's going to come back. And as you guys have ever used chat GPT, GPT types everything out one by one. Once the full thing is typed out and finished, it's going to put it in here. So now you have it's made shorter. I mean, how easy is that? Or you can create something yourself and add it in here. But let's say I want to start creating some whole new content and I want to, you know, house house to home. Maybe I want to do something new in here. I'm going to um, add a new text block. This is how you can build stuff in our system. It's really easy. So I'm going to build block in there. I'm going to drop in uh, text. Okay, I'm gonna launch AI. Here I want to write a three paragraph article with the top three things you must do to winter to prepare. your home for winter. We're trying to be descriptive. How long do I want it to be? I want to have top three things. So now you get into it. Top three ways to prepare your home for winter. Now I may come in here and um, highlight like number one, you know, I don't need to have a head in there anymore. I already know what that is. Top three ways to prepare for winter. So some of the formatting you're going to want to do yourself. That's kind of the human touch, right? Um, I can come in and see where's one. Weatherproof in. Let's go bold. Put one more space there. So it goes down. Maybe go to two. Now you can really do this for you know just about anything you want. I just created a three ways to prepare your home for winter. Now I might want to put a picture in there. I can come into an image gallery. I can upload a picture, drop a picture. You know any saved pictures I've ever you have in here will be in here. So maybe it's just going to be. You know, showing inside my house. Okay. Now, you know, that's an article. Uh, maybe I want to give them something besides how to make pear crumble. Uh, I want to... Oh, got to put up structures in there. Let's, I'm going to do a picture in the... So here I want to put in some text. Launch AI. Hi. So 
again, if you interact with chat GPT, this is running through chat GPT. So here we go. It came back. It's actually going to list that recipe, peach pie, ingredients, instructions, how to make it. You know, over here, I can put a new picture if I want to, you know, put a picture of a peach pie. Maybe I don't like that format and I can string, change the structure or the colors or again, whatever I want to do. Now I want to continue to add into my articles or my newsletter. And I want to put maybe at the very end, something about, I don't know how to, Write an article, let's see, write an article, write a five paragraph article with the top five things to can. I'm asking to do something a little bit more, five paragraphs, the five things to do. I like adding like, you know, five top things to do because it looks better when you're writing a newsletter or article or content to somebody. Um, but you can do this for, you know, basically anything. Real estate agents, you can say, write an article based off the perspectives of a real estate agent when trying to refer business to me. But, you know, again, this is something that is, you know, really impactful. Um, you know, one of the things that really helped grow and accelerate early on was our ability to build content and give people easy ability to um, get content up and running with their for their customers in different journeys. And it was always a struggle for lenders to be able to have access to content when markets change, really to write something and come up with like, you know, what's a new idea? What should I say here? Um, and so we, you know, we have a whole bunch of content over the years that we've created with best practices um, and, you know, we provide as a service. But we also just recently launched this in the platform as well. So if you want to go in there and start making more your own content, um, you're able to create your own content. And not just, you know, you can also take current content that you guys have, put it in the system, and you can, you know, fix grammar. Right? Obviously, this isn't going to have any grammar problems. You can make it shorter, make it longer. You can translate it, right? How's that, right? You start, you want to start marketing to someone in Spanish. You know, translate this to Spanish. Now you have all your content in Spanish. So that's great for if you're a bank and you're trying to meet requirements of being able to market in multiple languages, you're able to easily do that now. Change the tone of the voice. Make this friendly. Make this more curious. Make this worried, optimistic, engaging. Explain as an expert. Right? So how do you explain this as an expert? So it goes in there and it's going to change explanations as an expert. You can add emojis. I don't know if you want to add emojis, but some people might. Um, you're able to change tone of the voice. So now it's, now I'm explaining this as an expert. I want to, you know, make this shorter, make this longer. Again, really empowering you to have the ability to quickly come in here, um, create emails, create messaging, right? Grab text blocks, grab pictures, anything from a, from a, um, how to make a peach pie, to three way superior house for the home uh, for the winter, um, to you know market buying tips, you know that's the power of AI right now. It's just making um, the average person much more powerful, right? So I think you know if you haven't used let's say Chat GPT and this is the first time you've seen um, this, it's very similar to what this does. You're going to go in there and ask it to run you know things. Obviously, this won't do things like write code for you. Chat GPT will write code for you and do other things. This is really around content, creating content, fixing content, grammar, coming with articles, ideas, recipes, um, you know, empowering you to much more quickly uh, create messaging for your customers and um, your referral partners. So if you guys have any other questions, you know, really, um, it's great to reach out to us. Uh, you come to our website, Incelerate.com. You can request a demo, find out how we can help you, not just with, you know, giving you tools with AI. Uh, but also just tools to engage with the customers, whether you're trying to talk to them with email, text, phone calls. Um, we work with real estate agents or for referral partners. You want to track and manage those as well and give them tools to co-market with them. I'm mean, sorry, it has a platform for you. So thank you all again. Apologize for the uh, the delay. Um, this was a short webinar because truthfully, 
Um, but showing how you can use AI in our platform right now is pretty simple and straightforward. Uh, you just go into the editor, you add a text, and you tell it what you want it to do. Um, thanks again, and everyone have a great day.